did. Don't really matter, we got a problem. Why was that? You broke into my trailer. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pirates of all ages. It is I, your captain speaking. We are here, we got Tony in the house on a Wednesday. We got Uncle Michael in the house on a Wednesday. Good morning, everybody. How are you? What'd Wednesday you morning, stock. Yeah, California. beautiful day over here. Hey, we got, we're having yes, a little good time. We got a crew here now. What'd you say? Don't walk on my rug. Yes. Uh, Don't walk on my rug. Got the first rug out. Told you guys these were good rugs. Let's show you when they got them all pulled out. I don't think there's any stains on there, but you could see clearly something was there. Maybe the sun and the table here, and then the sun either lightened it or they came lighter. And the walking on it had the furniture there, and walking on it made it darker. Still a nice rug. Here's Tony Unruh doing the other rug. He is still on knife skill level one. He's learning to practice his knife I don't skills. Want to cut the rug. We're waiting for him to graduate to level two. Level five will be max level in knife skill. But I will cut a rug on the dance floor. Oh, let's see you dance. No. Come on, cut a rug, Tony. Too early, too early. Come on, buddy. Too early. Tony wants to use a professional man's well, knife. Oh. Well, you got a butter knife, Tony? Don't cut this right. Oh. There you go. Now we're Show him how to do it, Uncle Michael. Knife. Professional. Let me give you a real knife, Uncle Michael. See, Uncle Michael is almost graduated to level three knifing. Yes, professional. I am on level five, which is like the oh. black belt of knifing, and I will teach you guys that one day when you're ready. Catch the finger. Yeah, Uncle Michael thinks he's so cool with his Michael Kors watch and his diamond rings. Got some bling going on. Yeah, he's got his he's got his college football pendant on his necklace. Right, look at this big red rug. This is clean. Look guys, Jack actually does work. If you think that if you think that Jana does it all, he actually does work. It's not just Mama Nuts and Jana. Yeah. I could leash you an Uncle Mike. Yeah, I'm it is what it is. Want me to set you up a table in there, honey? Um, you know what? That's okay. I'll just bend down right here. It's fine. Maybe give her an empty big box. This one box here was part of the stuff that got robbed, the one wardrobe full. And like she bought like nice things. Oh wow. Like Ann Taylor and Calvin Klein and I just literally set all of it aside. We are going through things here again. Stuff for the internet, stuff to stay here. I let my lady make the choices because I am not good at this stuff. You not taking these? Yeah. I'm All right, I'll that. empty that. Are you gonna need one more box, maybe? Um, this is full too. Just um, yeah, maybe one more. All right. And ladies and gentlemen, she has whittled all that big pile down to these three huge boxes of stuff. She will once again put this on Poshmark, even though we will probably be starting our own soon. We've been taking internet sales heavy lately, so hopefully, um, I'm gonna try to get that woman to teach my woman how to do Poshmark if I could, or at least teach me and I teach her, because it's time to do that for myself, I think. Everybody's favorite time here, the gold and silver department. Because why? Pirates love gold, silver, and gems. What's this, what our total is? Is that with my fancy stuff? Nothing out, just this box right here. Okay, That's are you giving me extra for these fancy little things or no? Uh, what do you think? Aren't these real, aren't these nice? I don't know what kind of stun is that. All right. With you. Those are emeralds of what? 32. 19, oh, okay. Yeah. 14, Gold's high because money's down. <laughs> because of the whole thing that's going on right now, that brings the the stock market down, but that takes precious metals up. I like that. What are you doing? Taking them by the balls. Oh, taking them by the balls. Right on, Uncle Mike. See? And then you can like collect money and you open your boxes yeah. up and you're just like, hey, look at this. Oh, How did you that, find that is that cute. Look at that, guys. <laughs> Who doesn't want a cheeseburger? You want to go get it? I would love if you did. Because you want one, right? I got, I'll take it out of the oh, they got college funds. Yeah. What bedroom set? Yeah, dressing. I thought you had a soul for 80. Huh? I thought you had a soul for 80. No. I saw 80 bucks. Mm. Tony was gonna. What happened? Did you say no? Oh, I think he's mad. He has to go get him. Tony, are you mad? I'll go get it. Give me some money. You have money. Uh, I need five on the cable. Uh, dollar, dollar, dollar. Give me eight dollars. Eight? Yeah. Everything. 
Ocho, for total. She gave me a five for something. Four. Give me uh, another Give me four. Huh? Five. Oh, you give me five for the trash can. Hey, Jimmy. Cuatro. Right. I mean, a cinco. I need one dollar bill, Uncle Michael. Here's a dollar. Okay, okay you take the five. I owe her. She gave me a 20. Hang on, I owe you 15. Want a drink with my... With your cheeseburger, huh? How about a margarita? That. Does the Roach Coach sell margaritas? Right here? Okay. Yeah. Margaritas? Do they have them there? It's too early. All right. I'll take a water. Creamer, sugar, nut. Just fill that up. 20? I don't want those. You can turn those into 20s. Here. Walk through of everything we have here left to sell that's about to go into a sale of the dollar nature. Uncle Michael was trying to sell this for 80. It'll probably go for next to nothing. We got all sorts of things right here and here. All this will be in the dollar sale. And then it will be free. Except for these rugs right here. Those will not be those. This is for my taxes? Yep. Okay, How much will I spot today? 50 bucks. Okay. The bed frame. We still didn't even take the rest of the bed frame out, Uncle Michael. You still got it. You still could have took it out. That's a garbage pile. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you, honey. Adios. What are we going to do about this cabinet right here? All the people asked about this morning, we didn't sell it. Huh? So we're going to have to just give this away today because that's the only way we could do it. And we got this stuff here. And that's it. Ooh, look at you dropping stuff, Uncle Michael. I know. This is going to be worth $3. Okay, I need this. Please, that's first. Uh, another one. Another wine toppers, Uncle Michael. Bottle stoppers. Let's do uh, $5 for everything. All right. $5. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank where you at, honey? She's here at the flea market in Stockton, Uncle Michael. Three. $3 right here. And we just need a simple two more dollars. We'll put these all in the right fashion. You like that now, don't you? What? Your camera. Four dollars and five. Thank you very much. That one says the same thing, though. But it's, it's weird. Maybe they're still important because look. Professional Video Cassette Color Plus. No, 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 no. So this one is Andy Griffith, bro. I know, but this is just maybe smaller. Look, now that I think about it, this makes me think. Because look, it says professional on here. This mm -hmm. is still the way they did. I should set these all aside, huh? Mm -hmm. Just those ones. Oh, let me see here. Let me look these up. I remember where these came from now. They came from the TV producers unit. So what are these ones. Tyson Holmes, 1988. This the, he... Says war or something. War and remembrance. All right. That's an Indy 500. Yeah. Yeah, I can see. Look, ABC broadcast. That's what he did. I'll take a look at them. Uncle Michael threw these in here. He didn't think nothing of them. Okay, Uncle Michael. Yeah, blame everything on Uncle Michael. Blame it on him. That's the best thing to do. I can take the blame. I'll take the blame. All right. Look at this cheeseburger right here, ladies and gentlemen. Found cheeseburger. I bought an abandoned storage unit. Take this home, Mike. Take, 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 take. Keep going. Take, take, take. Keep going, George. We're having a relationship dispute here, guys. We do have a relationship. That's all you do. Yeah. Forty years now, man. Uncle Michael, we have a little domestic dispute here. We're gonna need you to step into this little lovers' quarrel. You guys, hold up, man. You don't want to take this home? No. What is it? I told you already. We got a we got a steam cleaner. She just I have to do it my own. yeah. We don't need that. How long has this truck been down? Eight months. Six, seven months. You know what the I think Tony's doing on purpose. For a fuel filter, and I'm not gonna get caught up in George's game. Well, how about you just get caught up in your own game? It's, it's 2020. You know, you got your 2020 vision on, Tony. Doing my own game. All right. All right, get a but truck. I know if I get it running, he's gonna want me to fill it up, take a load to the dumps for like forty bucks. No, you have only you already have a place. I know my partner. No, remember but how he, remember when we were back there? Yeah. All those times we were back there. Back in the past, over there. No, we're over here, Tony. We're over here in the future. 
<laughs> this is how annoying my day has been because of these guys who caused me problems. Not sure if that video will be out before or after this, but if it's not, make sure you stay tuned Saturday because you'll find out why I need to keep borrowing Jack's dolly. Jack, how you doing? I'm doing all right. Yeah. I'm not selling too much, but... Why not? Because I have crap. Why you have crap? Can I say that on your YouTube channel? You can say crap. All right. I don't have a super PC channel. I'm just slightly PC. <laughs> what is that? You told me there's seven cuss words you don't use, but some you can? Yeah. Crap is one. Yeah, you say that on the TV. The Simpsons say so. crap. Bart Simpson says crap all the time. He does. Jack wants you guys to see all of his crap. Crap, 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 crap. That was Jack, by the way, ladies and gentlemen. What are you doing for all this stuff? You make any money today? Yeah, a little bit. A couple yeah. hundred bucks. A couple hundred bucks. How you like my new... Uh, the new chest strap? Yeah, like, hey, how you doing? What's up, guys? That's cool. It's even got a little mirror right here. Oh, how's your hair look? Make sure I don't have any, like, nice. food on my beard or anything. Yeah. <laughs> how's that golden retriever coming along? <laughs> no? You need a little more cowbell in your video? Like, if I mailed Jana a golden retriever, would you get mad? Like if I just sent one to the house and it was alive and yeah, that's not a good idea. What would happen? We what? <laughs> I'd be putting it up for adoption. Some, somebody who's gonna be saving some money on a golden retriever. They'd be a well, they're pretty cheap and expensive dogs to obtain. Are they? Yeah, they're they're not they're on the lower end of dogs versus like a, a English bulldog or a Sharpay or something. They're a little cheaper. Oh, but that'd be a great mystery unboxing like in your fan mail box. I was, I'm thinking. Don't say it. I have it delivered. A dollar now. Have it delivered about 6:30 on a Monday. No. <laughs> Special delivery. Uh, <laughs> no, not a good idea. Hashtag Janet deserves a golden retriever. <laughs> I'm starting to like this camera, and I know this is not like just you, all the things y'all want to see, but the fact is, this thing makes it real handy. Ooh, thank you. Appreciate that. Good teamwork, sir. I'll definitely eBay this, George. George. Really wanted this bike. Somehow he found this. And he's traded me for that. All right, fair enough. Mine aren't very good. It's okay. I haven't really counted, but I'm like somewhere in this ballpark. Oh, money. You're going to drop that money. You keep showing it like that. You should spend some instead of keeping it in your pocket. Yeah. Well, I got plenty there. I know you do. Spend some. Jack, how much are you selling everything for? Free. Yeah. How come you don't put these on your little Amazon account? Don't you have an Amazon? Yeah, but... I know you. You probably got every account in the world. You're probably still using MySpace. <laughs> you, I want to see your MySpace. I want to see what you look like back there. Never had a MySpace. I was too old at the There's time. a type of stuff that as uh, uh, you and I are resellers that I think we lose so much money on because yeah. somebody's buying these somewhere. And like on Amazon or one of those accounts, there's got to be hot items they still sell. Just the time of listing it. I just told you my whole business plan. Imagine if we had all that. And then we could buy every storage unit in the world because no one could stop us. That's the real fun. Yeah. Yeah. You make $3 on every $1 item. Let's make it happen. That's the difference right there. Maybe as, maybe as a team we can make it happen. Jack, come on, get over there. You're 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 49. Yeah, why not? Who wouldn't take 15 on a TV? 15 minute warranty. Trade you for the wallet. No? No one ever wants to do that. What about your uh, red rug? What about it? We gotta get it up. Saving all these bills for Uncle Michael right here. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 6, 7, 6, 9, 8, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92. He called that. I got about 40 in my pocket. Oh, come on with this stuff, trying to be the boss stuff. You gotta humble yourself, sir. Uh, I'm not. You need to humble your. I've no. been humble for seven years. Oh, yeah? Seven years. I think you have, this guy's got a gun. He's got a gun. That's a gun. Like a real gun? Yeah. And what makes you so comfortable just walking around if it? It's not an AR-15. What kind of gun is it? It's relic. It's old. Okay. Like if a cop walk by, they're not going to be like, hey, 
Lay on the ground, sir. Right? Whatever you do, don't point that at me, George. I got taxidermy for you in the truck. Your money. Oh, my money, eh? Right now. Nice. I'll make you pull trigger. I think we're just going to walk away from everything today. We're not going to do a dollar sale. We're going to leave George and Tony, the billion, make some money here on this stuff. Look at Uncle Michael over there, ladies and gentlemen. He's hard at work, man. Is. Look, there's Uncle Michael's butt. Do I want some money? Where do you want to go? Uh, where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? Look at that. Let's see the money. There's some 20s. There's some 20s. It's not your best day. No, no, no. Uncle Michael did all the selling today. Uncle Michael, you really need my help with this? Remember when you were, remember when you were younger? Remember when you were younger and you were able to do all this? I still can. 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Alright, Tony paid for himself today at least. Hey, I was the good, good or bad? No, it's good. Me, I was, I'm trying to give me a woman for me. You got you if you came from court. Yeah. Then I found you guilty. It's a very specific drug. Yeah, that's in the specific Let's all take one, see what happens. It's for when your body's leaking? You got to pee a lot. Oh, yeah. It's for your kidney. That's a very specific drug. Wow. Take some. No. That's for, uh, also for tuberculosis. Um, Causes headache, urinary yeah. tract infections, uh, grumpiness, yeah. possible death. Did you just say I was your biggest customer? Yep. What did I buy? Today. My two auction items. Well, that doesn't technically count because that was Monday's sale. It doesn't, but the money's in my wallet, and that's what matters. To yeah, me. that's all right. So thanks. Don't forget to watch Jack's live auctions on Mondays. Mondays, 6 p.m. Pacific. And comment below here if you want to see me do it, too. Dude, don't really matter. We got a problem. Why, what's that? You broke into my trailer. I ain't breaking into nobody's trailer. Yeah, you did. Your partner. Yeah, you did. Go, go get the dude that said I broke into the trailer. Stuff, yeah. Straight up. You, you broke into my dash, you broke my window. No, 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 no. I swear to God in my life I did it, man. Straight up, I did it. Why is some dude telling me you go are? Get me. Hey, I'll go with the, go get the dude right now. You know where I live What's at? What's his go name? We already we already been to your house. Yeah, I know. I, I talked to my dad. Somebody came to my house. I didn't know who it was. I did. Well, you go get the dude and bring him to my house. I, I stayed my life on He was in this storage with you a couple weeks ago when he came to my storage looking for you. He was in what? He was here at this storage with you a couple weeks ago. Coming when you came in here, he came looking for you. And walked up to my storage looking for you. Oh, black George! I don't know that dude that good. He's Hispanic. Yeah, but regardless, I didn't break into nobody's stuff. Yeah, you go get him, drag him down to my house. We, I'll, I'll take care of it. All right. Wait, if you want, I'll jump in right now. We go. I don't want to be rolling around dealing with this. No, I, I well, I got the cops involved already. So, but yeah, someone he told me you did it. So. I'm gonna let them deal with it. So, I'll, I'll, hey, if he, if he knows you guys, I'll go grab, grab him and I'll, I'll, I'll find, find out where you guys are at. All right. We are cleaning up the storage. And amidst cleaning up the storage, we have to do some things. We find our one box, and here is a cremated remains. The wicked part of this business. The person who owned this unit, they passed away. The people who had the storage facility, they don't want nothing back from this. They said just throw it all the way or they will. I can't do it, Peanut. That's why I have this right here. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this right here. If you haven't, this is my collection. I don't know what to do with this. Comment below if you know of any legal matters or way to, just, to uh, put these people at rest. But these are all the remains that I end up with with storage units that they won't take nothing. Just want me to throw everything away from. We are about to get going on some unboxing. I got Uncle Michael here. We've been making room in the storage. Look at that. We're getting somewhere finally. We're doing things for Craigslist. We're getting everything prepped. This will be the unboxing area. This is stuff that needs to be photoed. And we got all this left from the palace. We're going to get the furniture set up and go through the boxes. Ooh, got that CD collection right here. What do we have here? Sumi Joe. All right. I don't know the value on any of these at all. Maybe we'll find something else in here. The greatest all-time movie songs. Killing me softly with his song. Nope, the sweetest thing. The sweetest thing I ever knew. All right, this looks like all CDs here. It just so happens that my CD guy will come, be, come over here in a second. Some books. And 
Japanese or Chinese, maybe. Ooh, these ones look kind of good. Have to see about the, they put on the barcodes. Yes, they do. We'll check that out. Those could have some value. If you guys know, please let me know in the comment section. All right, what do we have here? These are neat. I forget what they are called, but you set them up and they bring good luck. This one takes batteries. They usually just swing, and that is uh, for good luck. My monks use those. Ooh, look at this nice little rock right here. Nice. Uncle Michael, I'll give you, uh, I'll give you 10 bucks if you put your tongue on this. Come on, $10, and you, all you gotta do is put your tongue on. What? No? We're not taking this down of meat, Uncle Michael. That's stickly. I think that we're gonna... Stockton? No. You think we're gonna, okay, cause she wants to do Alameda again. This is the exact overkill you used to put on stuff. I, I remember I used bands cause I was professional and you used tape. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. This is called overdoing it. Now we know how drivers felt back in the day. This one looks empty, but it's a nice little dresser. Paperwork. It's got screws in it for the wall. Mm, smells good too. Right. This one has some stuff in it. Oh, that's not a jewelry box. Uh, unmentionables. Ooh, um, what is this? A personal massager. That's for your back, guys. Don't get bad ideas. Stuff. All sorts of little. Look at all these little gloves and stuff. Look at these little socks. Those are kind of cool. Huh. Interesting. There's lots of them. Okay. Stuff. Nope, nothing. All right. What do we have in here? Come on. Oh, it's another one of them rugs, I think. Let's pull this out. Come over here. So how are you guys liking this camera thing so far? I don't know, it's kind of wavy and jumpy. It's a blanket. One of these massage things for your chair at home? No. I was looking for something like that the other day. I saw some at the flea market yesterday. They're blue. Thought about getting them. But what do we need another table for? I don't know. Bedding. It looks exciting, ladies and gentlemen. Bedding. Okay. Ooh. I like the way this looks on three, two, one. Lift off. Nice. What is this? Oh, I thought this was something different. Need a little cube, Uncle Michael? Why are you breaking things? What do you need what? A little cube. Right here. No, why do something like that? Something. You can just put it some places and have pretty things. Fancy man. Where's all your good stuff at, fancy man? Ooh, look at this. This might be fancy. Look at these hats here. Hollister, ooh, Hollister. He likes the A. Why are you I'm banking boxes while you unwrap. That's what the agreement was. Do you remember? No. What do we have here? Rallisk, Ember, huh? Art and Life, okay. That's kind of cool, let's find some of that. Set of four of these. Hmm. 2750. Look at this. Look at that piece, Uncle Mike. What do you think that's worth? No, it's hand blown glass. Duh. Okay. And the cups are cool. What is this? Flatatron. Union Company Stoneware, that's nice. What's in here? What's in here? Ooh. -hoo. Jackpot. We got a Yakpot. Flanatron. Chain. Found change jar. I bought an abandoned storage unit. What are these though? Because these look like they could have some pricey value to them. 
I never heard that brand before. They're kitchen stuff. I don't know, like what, utensils or something? No, it has a lid. Look at that, tools of the trade. Brand new. 20 bucks in Stockton. West Elm, it's nice. Those are good salad bowls. I think I want these two for my house. Huh? Paper. Wood ball. Wood ball just hit the ground. Ooh, what do we got here? What is that, Uncle Mike? Did you just break something? No, it's loose. There's a place right here with a bolt in there. Oh, uh, wow. Right down. That's kind of neat. Interesting. That's pretty nice. Anything in there? Nope. It's a little scratched, though, huh? Not really bad. I, think probably... I mean, not really bad, but... Is that internet, or is that Stockton? Maybe you can pen. Do you, do you do pen touch up? Right. Look at this. We'll have to look this up. Nice. That could be something right there. That could be like a. $7,000 rare abstract art. We should make a thumbnail and it's just this little bag and it's, we'll just title it Found Parts. How many people you think would click into a video titled Found Parts? Uh-huh. Uh, like six people. That's for the couch. That's for the modern looking Ikea couch thing we have. Yeah. This one's in a little bit better shape. You gonna read that to us? My heart. I'm just looking for money. Oh. We fight and we bicker regardless of feelings, though. We love, we listen. Whenever I am with you, I can truly feel so at peace and content with where I am in my life. You know, that's like how every one of these we read starts out. Yeah, here's your chewing gum. You complete me. People, you complete yourself. Chewing gum. Right on, Uncle Michael. Thank you for the chewing gum. Let the good times roll. Come on, good stuff. Something exciting. Oh, exciting blankets. Exciting pillows. Why not exciting... Louis Vuitton. No. You just like to talk about those or what? Well, no, you like to talk about those in your living room. Uh, some people keep those chewing gums in their living room. Look at that. Comment below if you keep your chewing gum in the living room or next to your bed. All right. Ooh, come on. Be a lock safe in there. No, that would have been a nice hiding spot for something. Okay. Pride and prejudice. Two things that are very not good to have. Oh, don't take, use your pride. No, in the wrong manners. Definitely not prejudiced. What? That is nice. Look at you go, Uncle Michael. Teamwork over here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I'm going to work out. Look at that, guys. Ooh, look at this right here. I remember seeing this box. PlayStation 2. In some other language. Look at that. Not these are valuable. No. This is valuable. This is Final Fantasy 7. Oh, my gosh. Look at that, forty-seven eighty. I don't know what's in here. Let's see. We got the books, the game. Oh wow, this could be priceless. Parasite Eve two. Wow. PlayStation one. I don't know because I know vintage video games are hot. I don't know about these though. Look at that. All right, we got some more here. Ooh, more PlayStation two. Look at this, vintage PlayStation 2, but it's in like, oh, I wish I knew the language. These are dope though. Lege Dual Saga. Ooh, Velvet File. I don't know. Biohazard Chron Chronicles. Outbreak. 
Tales of Test Destiny. I, I can tell you a tale of destiny. Ooh, I can tell you a tale of knocking all your games off the thing too. Hey, Alex. Hey, Michael. Say hi to the whole world. I'm filming you. Are you? Yeah. Holy crap! Bye. Why? You show me that hair. <laughs> you show me your hair. What's up, whole world? What's up, whole world? We're, we're, we're just recording. I got you on chess cam, and I was just going to let you say hi before I turn the film off and then go just have our private conversation. Oh, okay. Bye, whole world. Bye. Oakland demo. Interesting. That's another musician. It is. Did I find another band? Okay. I'm thinking I did. That's them. This is neat. Snow White, Cinderella, and the best animations. Wow. All right. And then we got some more Disney movies here. Have to look into these. Gold Collection, Aristocats. La Bella Y Bestia, Beauty and the Beast. Best love story ever. See that little link? Right there. Time. So we got. All right. What can we pull out here? Blankets. No. Blankets. All right. Jay's on my feet. What size are these? Ooh, come on. Be a good size. They don't say. Nike cleats. Come on, good pair of somethings. Lost Sport. Those are kind of cool. Ooh, there's the other one. Those are nice. Those are clean. Jump man, jump man. Not to be confused with the ones the lady we gave to her yesterday and she sold for. Ooh, Heelys. Those are neat. I've always wanted a pair of Heelys for my size. Those are kind of cute almost. Arturo Polo. What do we got here? More golf shoes. These are like uh, $70 sandals. Only one pair of J's. The rest are just regular shoes. All right. I want something. Buy me some, something pretty. Ooh, look at that. That's what that one thing. Yeah, end tables. Actually, they were using a light table. It's a little bit older, though. LG. That's 40 50 bucks still. Do we have a piece of glass on something? I don't know what has that piece of glass. That's the kind of clothes that we're going to have here. That's kind of cute. Nice. What's this? That is kind of cute right there, actually, too. That's money on eBay. And it's your superior remark recommend quality. Juicy. Do 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 do. Juicy Couture. Our clothes lady will go through all this and she will pick out things that she likes. We can save those. Doubt she'll like that. You gotta try. Paul Scotty James. Ooh, she might like those though. We're gonna pause for a quick Starbucks break. Would you guys like some? Having fun over there, Uncle Mike? Oh, yeah. Look at them go, ladies and gentlemen. Good. This is quality work. When I was saying quality work, I wasn't necessarily mean Uncle Michael. I was mean the way they, they packed everything. Another nice table. I hope we have nightstands for that because that would be a good little set. That's a nice. That's cute. Blame it on the weekend. All right. We'll save all this for the lady to look for on her Poshmark. She'll choose things. Wool sweaters. Never heard of that brand. But this is where my Poshmark lady comes in. She looks like, I got $100 for this. All right, thank you. Ralph Lauren. Look at that. This is a TV stand, isn't it? What is well, it? It does, but... This right here. Oh. Is it? Nice, huh? 
Yeah, I thought it was one of the ones where the TV can raise it back. No, but it's still equally as nice. It's still a nice piece. It's missing something right here. That sucks. Somewhere, somewhere's a piece of glass. It's got to be packed. You should have this sold already. Can you call one of your people up? That's a nice piece. That's kind of cool. Tommy Hilfinger is a good brand, so that is probably something that she will definitely hush mark for us. These vests are pretty trendy. It doesn't have a, na a brand name on it, but I don't know. So we are kind of separating clothes. We'll have our lady from Poshmark obviously go through some stuff. But if I see cool stuff for Alameda, because we will be selling there again soon, I'm setting it aside. And we'll have like a little clothes rack out there, because why not? What size are these and what are they? Okay, Potter's Pot. That's interesting. Tory Birch, those are expensive. Stuff like this that has that vintagey feel, that is good for Alameda. Most definitely. Not stuff like this. This is like Poshmark Lady stuff. This right here. What are these? Like the jean version of stretch pants? Wow. Who makes these? Jeans. The jeans company does. More quick wardrobe here. That's stuff. I'll just show you guys what I think is cool. Oh, for a second there, I thought that was going to be cool, but it's not Burberry, it's Bubble Bubble. How would I do this out there? No, that's a painting, Uncle Mike. Of what? I don't know. I like the painted frame. I like the coloration of it. It's rare. Is this a signature? That's just part of it. It's not the signature, oddly. No. It might not be very valuable, but I don't usually like these, but... You know what I like? What I like about this one is just the color. It's not like it's just black and white. That's how life should be, just black and white. Boom. Cut and dry. Simple and bold. Right there. there J-S-H. Interesting. I want to look this one up. I like the color painted frame. And I actually like this. It might be good on the wall. Nice. Which one does this come out of? That is weird. Is that a dishwasher? Yes. Why is it got why is it double sided like that? It's a washer and a dryer. It is not a washer and a dryer. What in the hell is this? This is kinda cool, but that's warm. Avalanche. It's probably snow gear. This looks like total North Face type stuff, and that's like what's hot there. It's North Face. It depends on what the top is. Oh, what are these? More clothes after we just took the one out. He said, be careful. Careful with my little name, Uncle Mike. You didn't know that? What are these? Come on, be some Lululemons. No, not Lululemons. They look like jeans, though. A bit of it stops, because Uncle Mike had to say the F word again. You guys want to know why I'm on him all the time? He's a potty mouth. You're playing as simply a potty mouth, Uncle Mike. It's like a little, I think it's like a sushi table or something. Look at these. These are cool. Are we going to do this? Are going to kick it to you? Yeah, my leg might give out. Kick it to me then? You. Okay. That's what we have to do, guys, because Uncle Michael demolished this piece of furniture. So here we are carrying it out. And he can't walk, so we're walking backwards. Now we're walking forwards again. I'm going to walk in now. Look at all this mess we got going on here. I just wonder. I should get a head cam too. Let's take one second. Trick people. Legs off. You trick people? That's what it takes. That's what it takes? By any means necessary? Yes. Okay. Like Ladies and gentlemen, Uncle Michael X. By any means necessary. Just saying, you're not doing a very stand up job. Ralph Pallorn, Polo. The damage? I didn't do any damage. Taught you everything you know. I feel like there's a lot of good Alameda stuff here. We're going to see. I'm going to spice it up this next run. Do something a little different. Uncle Michael, what'd you break? No. Some bikinis. What is that? Bikinis. Ooh. Look at that cute little thing. I'm talking like that. Look at that. That's cute. This looks like something cool. 
even college wear. Probably a hot item in Alameda. This is a good, I don't know, it just seems like trendy stuff to me right here we're pulling out. This is an expensive scarf. Not Hermes. Polo. Those look polo-y. All right. That's weird. This is so Alameda here. So we will set this aside and bring that to Alameda. It's a weird little glass lamp. I'm unsure because it's been a long day, but I think we've covered a lot of boxes in this unboxing. So we're gonna have to just cut it. I don't know if we've even found anything too exciting. The most exciting thing was a vintage PlayStation 2 video games, which I will send off to someone who sells stuff for me. You'll find that out very soon. With that being said, I love you. Don't forget to get, check your notification button. Tell Uncle Michael you love him. 